up everyone welcome to a brand new review today we are talking i tony yes guys this is the biopic that stars margot robbie playing tony harding yes one of the most impressive skaters one of the most controversial skaters out there and i didn't know a lot going to this one about tony harding personally i was more intrigued to see more about this film just because i like learning stuff about history i like learning stuff like this and I love the cast. I really am a big fan of Margot Robbie. So anything she's in, I'm game. I'm I, Ever since Wolf of Wall Street, just because she's hot, she really proved to me that she's not just a hot girl. She is a triumph in acting. The fact that she can hold her own with Leonardo DiCaprio, and this film is one of those. This is one of the best performances I've seen all year, and this is easily one of my favorite films of all year. I am so happy that I got the chance to see Itonia before putting together my top 10 list, because this film is going to make it onto my top 10, maybe even jump into my top 5. I say that because this film moves at such a great pace. It's so fast-paced, it's so energetic, that there's not a single time that I check the time to see when is this film going to end. And I did check once, just wondering how much time had passed, and it was like an hour and a half in. And I was like, oh my god, that went by so fast. And that is great that a movie can keep my attention and lock me into the point where I'm not even worrying about what time it is or what anything. I am so engrossed into this story. And that is one of my favorite things about Itonia. The director really captured all that and had you so intrigued to the story and to Tony Harding's life. But yes, we're talking about Tony Harding and Margot Robbie portrays her brilliantly. This is, like I said, one of the best performances I've seen all year long, and she is my pick for Best Actress this year for any award she is up for. I think she deserves every nomination, and she deserves to win, because this is I've seen every big performance from an actress this year, and this is the one that I'm going to say should win. I think there are some moments in here that almost hit me in the heart and emotionally it hit me and almost made me cry. It takes a lot for a film to do that, so she strikes some chords with me and I have to give Margot Robbie big props for that. I'd like everyone to know that she's not just the only great performance in here. Everyone brings it on par. Sebastian Stan plays her husband in here and Sebastian Stan's amazing. It's great to see him not just play the Winter Soldier. It's great to see him in here giving more of a dynamic role. And Sebastian Stan, I can't wait to see what else he does next. The other big performance in here that a lot of people are going to be talking about come award season is Allison Janney, who plays Tony Harding's mom. She is brilliant in this role. She's a hardcore, tough mom, tough on the luck, and she just plays the role brilliantly. That's the whole point you're just like, I can't believe this is going on. But you guys look at the interview at the end of the film where they go and actually show the real life people it's insane they margot robbie and allison really portray these people like spot on now honestly as much as i love this film i think some people might have a complaint with this film i i think the film is near masterpiece perfect i i really don't have any issues with the film but i think there are some dumb characters in here just dumb and i know i i did some research before doing this review that most of these people were actually like this and they actually did this and it's insane you'll understand when I see the film. I know a lot of his comedic relief, but you're just baffled by how dumb some people are in this film. And it's more of just, this is real life. This is what really happened. Some parts. Some parts were fictionalized, and some people, some parts they don't even know. But like I said, there, there are some dumb things in here that happen that really are from comedic relief. But in real life, when you look it up, you're like, that is so stupid. At the same time, I really liked that aspect. I liked what this film had going for. She breaks the third wall. She talks to the audience. She lets you know what's going on. This is Tonya Harding's story and Margot Robbie's triumphant acting performance of ever. And this is one of her best performances already in her career. The fact that she's, we know that she's going to be doing more down the road is insane. Absolutely love Daytonia. It made me appreciate figure skating more. It made me love the characters. It made me want to look more into all this actual situation that ever happened. Because if you guys know about Tonya Harding, you know some of the events that do happen in here. I'm not going to spoil them if you don't know anything about it. All I can say is, go see I, Tonya. This is a film that will keep you on track and keep you engaged into the whole story the whole time through. This is easily one of the best films of this year. If you love biopics, if you love dramas, if you love a big buzzworthy Oscar movies or award season movies, or even just seeing fantastic performances, this film is for you. I cannot recommend Itonia anymore. So with all that said, I'm going to give Itonia an A+. I absolutely loved Itonia, and I cannot wait to go see it again. I'm going to really push this week and go see it one more time before Christmas, because I have to see Itonia again. It is that 
good of a movie. I am so engaged, and I've never felt this comfortable saying that about a film in a long time, that I'm so sure on this score of an A+. I really did not see a single problem with this film, and maybe that's different for some people, so this is where you guys are going to talk to me. Comment down below and tell me what did you guys think about Itonio. Were you disappointed? Were you kind of like, eh? Or were you just like me? Fantastic film. I want to hear it down below, guys. Of course, guys, make sure to go check out Sam and Sean Films down below and make sure to go check us out because, of course, we give giveaways and advanced screens and do tons of movie news and reviews on this website. I love being a part of this, so make sure to go check us out down below. But, of course, guys, until next time, make sure to look out for more reviews soon and stay classy and have a great rest of your day.